Hello everyone, very good morning and good evening. So today the question I want to answer is what is basis module and who are the consultants who should go for the basis module? I got a lot of questions uh, and a lot of queries that I have this profile, which, which modules I, I can jo join in SAP. So I thought of that, I will provide a quick clarification on uh, what is basis module and whether you are the right candidate to join the SAP basis. Now in SAP, we have a different stream, right? We have a functional stream, then we have a technical stream, right? Functional stream, SD, MM, PP uh, are the ones which are there into the functional stream. Generally, we say the people, okay, if you uh, are from the operations, if you don't know the coding, you're not much into the coding, you can go and become SAP functional consultant. And then we have a technical stream. In general, the technical stream comes where basically we have a ABAP, we have a UI5, we have a Fury, where a lot of coding is required that people go into the technical stream. But there is one substream in, in the technical stream that is called basis. Now, the basis consultants are those consultants who work on to make sure that they would be uh, implementing the server, the, the, all the networks, all the connections, and the server implementation the licensing part and uh, uh, downloading the patches and making sure any kind of troubleshooting is required, making sure all kind of admin works is required. So when we install SAP server, we need to do a lot of steps. We need to complete it to make sure that our application has been uh, implemented on the server. So a lot of patches need to be required. A lot of things we need to download from SAP and then uh, then apply it. Then on time on time time to time basis, we need to also make sure that the technical upgrades, technical patches has been implemented. So all this technical part of work has been handled by the basis consultant. So the basis consultants are the con technical consultant who are not much into the coding. They don't write the codes, but they do the admin work. They would be there would be a set guidelines given by the SAP that okay if you want to implement this. If you, if you want to implement SAP note, okay, that is additional fun function. If you want to activate a business function, right? Or if you want to migrate your system from ECC to S4 HANA, a lot of admin related work would be done by the admin, uh, by the basis consultant. Apart from that, the basis consultant also include into the security part. Who would be able to do what kind of transaction that security and roles and authorization is also a substream of basis. All this work which basis consultant does is called the technical work, but without coding. So if you are the one who are interested to be more into the technical side, you don't have any kind of operations experience, you have not worked in sales, you are not working in procurement, but uh, you are into the technical side of it, but still you don't want to go into the deep of the coding. So there is a stream in SAP that is called uh, uh, SAP basis where you would be a technical guy, but not doing the coding. SAP would be having a set of instructions which you will be following it. And many cases when the things does not work or the system is working slow, you need to investigate, you need to troubleshoot that all troubleshooting work also would be done by the basis team. So basis can be a profile for all of the consultants who want to jump into SAP. They are technical, they are coming from the network domain, they are coming from the hardware domain. They don't want to shift, jump into the deep of the coding part, but still they want to do the technical work. Basis is the stream for you. Basis is the word, the stream which you can look forward. There are very good opportunities in basis because whenever we implement SAP, uh, basis consultant are must. And after implementation also in support because there's a lot of upgrade. There is all a lot of uh, patches need to be upgraded. There's a lot of add-ons need to be activated. Those all work would be done by basis guy. I hope with this quick information, you know that what is basis module and who can go for this basis training.